Panini, Jurassic World Dominion starter pack, brand new, includes album, 26 stickers, 5 cards, a card holder, 1 limited edition card, welcome to the channel, yes we're going to have a look at this sticker starter pack from Panini, let me know your thoughts on it when we uh, do the review down there below, love to hear what you think of it, have you seen the film yet? And don't forget, press that little bell over there to get the videos to whatever media you are watching on in case you don't want to miss anything in the future. Let's have a look on the back, folks. It's uh, £4.99. It's got a 32-page al sticker album, as I said before. Also inside, uh, Dinosaur Country Official Guide Ticks, Tips and Tricks to Survive the New Jurassic Adventure. We've got Glow in the Dark sticker, map, poster, 50 cards to collect. And we've got uh, various other things. Let's get straight in there and see what we can find. Just saw this today, thought let's get it out, get a review on it. We've done loads of reviews now on this channel, with all the different sticker starter packs. Plenty more coming up. Here we go, folks, straight away. You can have your 10% off if you like, uh, entering the code JW, uh, obviously Jurassic World, JW310, you get 10% off. 36 packs in the box, 29 pound, 16 pence. There we go, go online to get that. Right, let's get straight into, ooh, threw the limited edition away. Gigantosaurus. I don't know if there's another half to it to go here or this is just it, I don't know. Limited edition card, don't know at the moment. Is there any other limited editions or is that the only one? I'll have to have a look when I go back into the shop. It probably tells us in here. Let's have a look at the different sticker packs, all different dinosaurs on the front there. Very nice. See the same ones. So you get five packs. Five stickers and the card in there, probably. Let's have a look. So, we get stickers at the front. We get stickers at the back. And we got the box that you can build to put the cards in. We got 50 collectible trading cards. Let me bring those up. Can you see those? I think you can. Quite small pictures of them, but there's 50 different cards. Uh, what's it? Uh, Dino tr Tracker. Key moments, Jurassic World Dominion, you have been targeted and tools. Let's get straight in there and see what we can find. So we're going for the unauthorized testing area. Put your name, surname and age in there. Where were we? I'm not gonna even say that name of that one. Velociraptor in the woods. We have done a uh, dinosaur sticker album before. If you look back, uh, I've already done a sticker album on it last year, was it? That's with the uh, 3D um, cards in them that used to go up and down. Lenticular cards, should I say. Biosyn Sanctuary, Malta, Baronyx, is it? Baronyx. Velociraptor. Sub level six beta mode. That one there. Could have given the easier names to say. Uh, so, this is the uh, official guide for using and tracking and treating dinosaurs. <coughs> uh, big poster there. I hope I'll get that out and show you on the screen what that looks like. So, you've got both parts of it here. Let's put that the other way so you can see what it looks like. I've seen that they're open up. A big poster, double sided poster. We've got uh, towards Biosyn, one of those Biosyn Forest, Breaking the Ice, Pyro Raptor. Good artwork in there, I like those artworks. Amber Mines, Diamond Tron, Outpost. Uh, Binosin Valley, Gigantosaurus, Velociraptor, Locating Beta, 
we got escaping we got what's next so we've got 154 stickers i don't know plus the ones on the poster as well see you at the next roar and he's coming straight towards you t-rexes let's get straight into the stickers that's the thing you're after that's what you want let's have a look at the back very nice too let's get and see exactly what we can find in here some of the cars look interesting look some look a little bit plain we got c is it 47 c50 i don't know what that is looks like a something amber mine cart looks a bit boring there got that one we've got a one of the dinosaurs going up the tree it looks like can i actually oh, i better show you the back there haven't i d39 these i think are glow in the dark i think that down there is going to glow in the dark eventually so we've got a double sided so you get four stickers oh, it's quite plain aren't they four stickers and a card I've got any shinies here let's hopefully with this part that could be a bit better i know the last one i really like the dinosaurs in that one Alco, Alcatraptor is it? Alcatraptor, that's quite a nice looking card. 92. The stickers are quite plain. I, I, I was actually, I'm so far very surprised. They, they don't pop out. It might be just that sort of section of stickers and we've got uh, one from the film. Let's see if we can see what something else. As I say, let me know. Well, we've got a couple of stickers that are shiny in this one. Let's see what we've got. I mean, that's a just a hat. 43. We've got... Uh, that looks like a map. Isn't that part of a map? All right, let's have a look at these ones. These are rainbow foil. T-Rex there, looking really good. And whatever that one is. Doesn't sound like that. We've got two shiny rainbow foils, not too bad. Let's have a look in the next pack. These are probably about 90 feet. I'll put in the description just how much they are a pack. And we have got uh, one from the film there. Very nice. And a rainbow effect one. Not quite as elaborate as the last dinosaur sticker album some of these are looking quite plain actually really i was thinking they're going to be really colorful and pop out the screen but no and we've got a two of the same card as well number 32 we've got a fingerprint we've got uh diplodocus it looks like or something like that oh tell me your thoughts on that I, I, at the moment, looking a little bit plain there, I think, the stickers. Some of the cards are a bit boring, to be quite honest with you. But then again, I haven't opened a lot of them. I only opened, like, what, four packets. The rainbow foils look quite nice. And when you get ones of the uh, screen, they do look nice, but something's missing about them. They don't jump out at me and go, wow. But the shiny ones look quite nice. Anyway, let me know your thoughts down there in the comments section. Give the uh, review a thumbs up. Uh, until next time, happy collecting.